Plastics have significantly improved our modern life. From packaging that preserves food, sterile medical equipment, as well as comfortable clothing, and plastic piping that's crucial to provide clean water and sanitation. But plastics can persist in the environment for centuries, leading to pollution in our waterways and natural habitats. Fortunately, some plastics, like water bottles, can be mechanically recycled. But that same recycling process just doesn't work on other items like fleece jackets, underscoring the complexities in managing plastic waste effectively. Here at SLAC, as part of the Bottle Consortium, we work with our partners on developing advanced chemical and biological processes for breaking plastics back down to their chemical building blocks so that we can recycle many more types of plastics and the products that are made from them. We're also developing tomorrow's plastics, which are designed to be both recyclable and biodegradable. SLAC's role as a national laboratory is to use our unique tools to understand how we break plastics down to their building blocks, how we put those building blocks back together, and how we use those processes to create the products of the future. Using the x-rays from our synchrotron facility, we can literally watch as the molecular structure of a plastic breaks down when it's digested by an enzyme or a chemical process. This ability to follow the degradation of plastics in real time helps us to design new, more efficient processes that use less energy with less carbon emitted into the environment. The understanding we achieve from watching chemical and biological processes at the molecular and atomic scale is at the heart of developing processes to turn today's waste into tomorrow's products. This will enable a future where the end of today's plastics life is the start of tomorrow's plastic products.